You're watching WMBD This Morning. Welcome back. Before the break, you heard First Date Kiss perform their song, Garden of Eve. That's right, and the band members stuck around for an interview. They're joining us now. Hello. Hi. Hi. Glad to have you all here. So, first and foremost, can you give us a little background about your band and how you got started? Well, it started with Asher and I. Um, we met at an open mic at the Neon Bison in Peoria, and um, we hadn't we had like just been there for the first time and um i was just getting back into open mics and um well i started singing he bought me a drink and <laughs> uh he played the drums and i kissed him on the first date <laughs> oh, that's so cute and then after that we just kind of started um Forming more music together, and I liked him a lot, not because he's cute, but <laughs> because he um, he really heard my music, and it was really easy to bounce off ideas and start making more um, more music. And then Nate came along. And you can yeah, oh, I'll tell him, yeah. Um, I <laughs> saw them perform. I thought they were amazing. They were playing at Peoria Pizza Works, and uh, well, actually. I went to a show, and long story short, I was going to leave the show, and then I heard this beautiful voice and this drummer in the background, and I was like, who is that? I need to go back in and see who that is. Sure enough, I go back in, and it's these guys. I stayed the entire night, and I was like, man, it's just these two. They would be great if they had a guitar player. I was very timid. <laughs> I went up to them. I said, hey, are you guys looking for a guitar player? And the rest is history from there. But love that's, that. that's, I how love it. That. that's how it yes. started. Yes, <laughs> very cool. So do you guys take your inspiration of your songs from anywhere else? I I wouldn't say we, we take ins or we're inspired by um, artists for sure. I guess I specifically for writing um, music, I am really inspired by um, Alex Turner from the Arctic Monkeys. Okay. And Julian Casablanca's from the Strokes. Like their songwriting is very um, I don't know, you have to like dig into the lyrics to understand it a little more. And I like things that are a little uh, complicated to understand sure. lyric-wise, but um, music-wise, what do you say is an inspiration? I think it's all over for us here. <laughs> just, like, just like any other band, hard to explain, but. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't sure. even say we have a specific genre either. We're just a little, uh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. <laughs> there you go. So music for everybody. Yeah, right. I think Absolutely. so. Okay, so what's the writing process like? Usually I write the music first, or not the music, but I write the lyrics first, and then I write a sort of like melody, and then I pitch it to Nate and Asher, and they just start kind of building it together. And it takes a few practices to get it down, but. Um, Sometimes a couple shows, too. Sometimes the, the song can evolve once we play it live, and mm -hmm. yeah. think things just change while you're on the fly. And then by the time it hits the album, when, when we record, it's going to be different. Sure. Yeah. Well, so before we go, we want to make sure that people are av able to listen to your music and also possibly see you guys perform live. So where can they do that? Firstdatekiss.com. You can go there. Okay. Uh, check out all of our tour dates. Uh, we're playing October 7th at Kenny's Westside Pub with Little Victory mm -hmm. from Chicago. Good show. And then on the 21st, we'll, we'll be playing at Jack's Bar in Canton. Mm -hmm. Perfect. All right. Well, we want to thank you all. You just heard from First Date Kiss. Thank you all for joining us. Thank yeah, you thank for you having us. Of course. <laughs> and as always, we'll share these details on our website, ciproud.com. Just click on the WMBD This Morning tab under News.